Welcome back. Another cold day here in Flagstaff. Normally we're about 44 this time of year for our high record high of 67 set back in 1963. Normally our low this time of year is 18 degrees record low of negative 21 set back in 1985. Taking a look at our precipitation totals. We're a little bit above average right now for this time of year. Now, like I mentioned yesterday, we have that warming trend coming into the area and that's gonna bring some increasing temperatures, which I know I'm personally looking forward to. That's gonna start this weekend. But before I get to those much anticipated warmer temperatures, let's take a look at what we can expect tonight. Tonight, we're gonna get to seven degrees for our low, another breezy cold night in store for us here in Flagstaff. Now, tomorrow we're gonna start seeing those warmer temperatures getting to 44 for our high tomorrow. Now, while it's gonna be warmer, we are gonna have some calm winds come into the area but I'll take those calm winds to see a nice warm temperature, 44 tomorrow. Taking a look at our statewide temperatures tomorrow. Page topping out at 45 degrees. Tuba City getting to 48. Winslow, 50 for their high. Shola warming up about 8 degrees from yesterday, getting to 44 for their high tomorrow. Sedona getting to 55. Kingman warming up to 60. Lake Havasu, 68. And Phoenix warming up, getting into the 70s. Just dipping there, though, getting to 73 for their high tomorrow. Now, Looks like pretty much the entire state is going to start warming up with that warming trend we're starting to see in the region. Taking a look at our extended forecast here, like I said, starting to warm up going into mid next week, 44 tomorrow. Then we're going to see some clear skies coming into the area on Sunday, bringing us all the way through Wednesday, 48 on Sunday, getting to 52 Monday, warming up to 54 on Tuesday and back to 52 on Wednesday. Now, today is National Weather Persons Day, so I'd like to say a very happy National Weather Persons Day to our very own Lee Bourne and our former NAZ Today alum, Jordan Steele, who is now a meteorologist down in Texas. That's all I have for weather today. Stick around. We have more NAZ Today coming up after the break.